With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, in this question we have to find out the elements of symmetry present in a cubic crystal. So first of all, I will tell you that there are 23 elements of symmetry in cubic crystal. In 23 elements of symmetry there are axial axis of uh, sorry axis of symmetry there is plane of symmetry and there is center of symmetry now we will explain them one by one in axis of symmetry in axis of symmetry axis of symmetry these are 13 13 how they are c4 c3 and c2 c2 are two fold planes or two fold axes sorry two fold axes c3 are three fold axes and c4 are four fold axis now let's see about the c4 c4 axis are present are present along opposite face corner while c3 are present along opposite or diagonally corners opposite diagonally corners now c2 they are present along diagonally opposite edge center let's make a cube first of all in the cube we will see them one by one this is a cube here first of all we will see c4 c4 present along opposite face center opposite face center this is a face center this is a face center and this is body center so it will pass through opposite face center this is the c4 now there are six face center six face center and along and two face have one axis so there will be three c4 axis now let's see the c3 present along diagonally opposite corners now this is a corner and diagonally opposite corner is this one and this axis will pass through the body center this will be like this this is the c3 axis c three axis now there are eight corners and along two corners there is one axis so eight corners means there are four c three axis now let's see the next one that is c2 c2 is present along the opposite diagonally opposite edge center this is diagonally opposite edge center this is c2 and here is c2 and there are 12 edges so there will be 6 c2 now c4 are how much c4 are 3 
C three R four and C two R six. So there are total thirteen axes of symmetry. Now let's talk about the plane of symmetry. Plane of symmetry. Let's talk about the second one. Plane of symmetry. Plane of symmetry are of two type. One is diagonal plane. Diagonally plane, and one is rectangular plane. Rectangular plane. Now we'll make another cube. Then we will see them one by one. The diagonally plane are present. in the diagonally opposite corners how like this is the corner this corner and this corner so this will be the diagonally plane diagonally opposite plane so and in rectangular let's see rectangular how it will be formed in rectangular it will be present along the face center oppositely face center it will be formed like this this is a plane now this is present along the or a different uh, opposite edges so there are 12 edges means there will be Six diagonally plane, and this is present along the face center, opposite face center, and there are six face center, so there will be three rectangular plane. Now there will be one center of symmetry. Center of symmetry. Center of symmetry is the point in a cube like body center. In either direction you will move, you will find the same atom. Or at the uh, same atom at the equal distance. Now, this is the center of symmetry. You you can move in either direction. You will find the same thing or same atom at same distance. So this is the center of symmetry. This is one. Now there are axes of symmetry. R thirteen. Plane of symmetry. R nine. Center of symmetry are one, so total they are twenty three. So on the basis of this dis discussion, our answer would be twenty three. This is our answer. Thank you so much. For class six to twelve, ITG and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.